We ask and entreat you, O Lord, God the Father, the one to Creator and the Holy, and Holy, Only Begotten Son, the Creator and the Master of all, and the Holy Spirit, the Life Giver, the Holy Trinity, before who kneels down every knee in heaven and on earth. We ask you, Lord, to hear us and have mercy on all. Lord, have mercy. We pray for the heavenly peace. Harmony of all churches in all the whole world, the monastery, all the holy symbols, their dwellers and their keepers. O oh God, have compassion on your creation and save it from all evil. We ask you, Lord, to hear us and have mercy on all. Lord, have mercy. Through his power arranged the life of man before his creation and made for him all things with his wisdom and adorned the skies with stars, the earth with vegetation, trees and vineyards, and the valleys with pastures and flowers. Now, O our King, accept the prayers of your servants who place themselves in your hands, saying, We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. O great and holy God, who created man in your image and likeness and gave him a living and a reasoning soul, have mercy, O Lord, on your creation which you have created and have compassion on it, and grant us on your mercy from the height of your holiness. And from your dwelling we ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, you who saved your servant Noah, the righteous, his children, his wives, and the clean and unclean animals from the flood in order to renew the earth. Once again, we ask you, Lord, Hear us and have mercy on all. Lord, have mercy. Oh, you, the creator the, and provider of all, deliver your people from the flood of the sea of this passing world and prevent them, from, from, uh, prevent them along with animals from harm. Give all the birds their provision. For you are provide for all the peace and the young ravens, their food in due season. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on all. Lord, have mercy. All you who was received as a guest by your servant Abraham, the head of the patriarchs, sat at his table and blessed his offspring. O oh, our King, accept the prayers of your servants and your priests standing before you. Have mercy on the world and save your people from all hardship. Dwell in them and be in their midst. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. We ask you, Lord, to guard us from all evil and have compassion on your creation, all your people. For the eyes of everyone wait upon you, for you give them their food in due season. Ah, oh, you who gives food to our flesh, the help of the hel helpless and the hope of the hopeless. We ask you, O Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, you who looks to the humble with a watchful eye of protection, who saved the Joseph from his master's wife, Sit him a king over Egypt and all its way, and spared him the days of hardship. Then his brothers and father came, kneeled down before him, and took from him wheat for the nourishment of their children and their cattle. Likewise, we bow down with you, with our heads, and kneel before you, and thank you, our, our creator and provider, for this condition and in every condition, save us from all tribulation. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, God, the word of the Father, who works through the law, the prophets and all testament, and protects them. 
Save your people from all tribulations and govern their life according to your good will. Save us from famines and affliction. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. All you who supported the people of Israel for 40 years in the desert of Sinai, having no houses or storehouses, now, O oh my master, protect your people. Support them and bless their homes with the heavenly blessing. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. All you who accepted the prayer of Elijah the Tishbite when the sky rained and the earth gave fruit and blessed the barrel of flour and the cruise of oil in the house of the widow, accept the prayers of your people through the prayers of your holy saints and pure prophets. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, God, with eyes full of mercy, have compassion on the world and split their corpse and their storehouses, even the little that they have. Bring up the waters of the rivers according to their measure and grant moderation to the winds. Lead the Nile of Egypt and all the Niles this year and every year. Give joy to the face of the earth and sustain us. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, you who accepted the repentance of the Ninevites, when everyone fasted and, accept, and accepted the confession of the right thief on the cross, Likewise, may, likewise, make us worthy to please you and to gain your compassion, crying and saying, Remember us, O Lord, when you are come into your kingdom. Accept the repentance of your servants and their confessions, their fasting, their prayer, and their offerings, which are offered on your holy altar as a sweet incense, and have mercy on them. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. Are you the mighty provider, the chastiser, the healer, and the physician of souls and bodies, who tested his servant Job, healed him from his calamity, and recompensed him with more than what he had? Have mercy on your people and save them from all calamities tribulations, temptations, and hardships. Oh, you who gives victory to those who trust in him, we ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, Christ our God, the word of the Father, who sanctified his holy disciples, washed their feet, and made them pillars of faith, and leaders of the believers, who through them satisfied the yearning souls, and taught them to pray, saying, Our Father who art in the heaven, lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. We ask you, o Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, miracle and wonder maker, who fed the thousands with the five loaves, raised the dead and blessed the wedding of Cain of Galilee, now our master bled the bread oil, lands, behives, or tree, trades, and all the work of your servants. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, Lord, save your people and protect them with the life given sign of your cross. Read the state of the Christian all over the world and soften the hearts of the rulers toward them fill their hearts with compassion toward our brothers the poor and the needy and take away from all all them all evil we ask you lord hear us and have mercy on us Lord, have mercy all you who entrusted us with your holy covenant 
your body and blood on the altar daily through the descent of your Holy Spirit and the bread and wine, and commanded us, saying, Do this in remembrance of me. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. O Christ, our God, have mercy on your people and the successors of your apostles. Give blessings to the fruit of the earth and gladness to the heart of man through abundance of fruits and blessings. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. O oh, begotten of the Father, who was incarnate from the Virgin St. Mary, in the fullness of time, who said to his holy disciples, Go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them, teaching them to observe all the things that I have commanded you. I am with you always, even to the, to the end of the ages. Be, all, be also with your people who cry unto you, saying, We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. Oh, forgiver of sins and giver of gifts, forgive the sins of your people and cleanse them from all uncleanliness. Wash them from all deceit and keep them from bearing false witness and all envy and slander. Take away from their hearts all evil thought, suspicion, unbelief, pride and hardness of heart. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. You are the fortification for our salvation, or Theotokos, the invincible fortress. Take away the counsel of the adversaries and turn the afflictions of your servants into joy. Defend our cities, fight for the Orthodox kings and rulers and intercede for the peace of the world and the churches. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. O oh God of mercy and compassion, Lord of all consolations, do not be wrathful with us. Do not rebuke us for our evil deeds, nor for the multitude of our sins. Do not be angry with us, nor let your anger endure forever. Hear, O God of Jacob, and look down, O God, our helper. Protect the world from death, scarcity, pestilence, wars, earthquakes, horror, and all fearsome events. We ask you, O Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. For the sake of our protection under the, your mighty ha holy hands, O oh God, we ask you to keep for us the life of our honored father, our patriarch, Bob Abba Shenouda III. Keep him in his sea for many quiet and peaceful years. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. O oh Christ, our God, we ask you for the goodness of your great mercy to keep for us the life of our fathers, the metropolitans, the bishops, the hierarchs, the rulers, and the shepherds. Confirm the sheep of your flock. Give protection to the priest, purity to the deacons, strength to the elder, understanding to the youth, a chest to the virgins, ascetism to the monks and nuns, purity to the merit, and protection for women. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy. Also, we ask for the safe return of the travelers and the lost, the support of the widows and orphans, abundance for the poor, those who are in debt, pay their debts and forgive them, and those who are in prisons and distress, give them release, heal the sick and repose the departed. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy. O oh God of our saintly fathers, do not neglect those whom you have created with your holy hands. 
All you who showed his love to mankind, except from your mother intercession on our behalf, and save us, all you the Savior of the humble, for, forsake us not, neither renounce us unto the end. For the sake of your holy name, do not revoke your covenant with us, nor deprive us for, of your mercy for the sake of your beloved Abraham, your servant Isaac, and your Saint Jacob. We ask you, Lord, hear us and have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy.